Hello, and welcome back to Monster Hunter Sunbreak. Just because we finished the main story doesn't mean we are done with the game. After all, by finishing the main story we just unlocked a whole bunch of new stuff, and I'm excited to see what it is. Now then, outstanding work, R. Thanks to your help, the threat to thanks to your help, the threat to the kingdom is no more. I want to express my gratitude too. I'm quite sure that without you, we wouldn't have made it through this. The Kuryu have totally lost their hopes now. They'll slowly die out. Or they should at least. Not overly convincing, Bahari. But they are real pests, this Kuryu. We cannot rest until their threat has been completely eliminated. Agreed. I mean, they sucked the life out of that Anjana. I guess it was some kind of homing instinct kicking in that made them so aggressive. But it could happen again. I hate that all quiet in camera are. So I ask that you stay on here in Elgato if you don't mind. I ask the same. Nothing gives me greater assurance than having your skills to fall back on. Oh. You'll stay? Wonderful! We're deeply indebted to you. I believe Chiche has new quests that need your attention. Yeah. Don't worry R, we'll keep watching the Kuryu and with Team Elgato the kingdom has never been safer. We are out. Now then, let's get to talking to people. Are you putting your palicos to work, Hunter? I have some information that might be great benefit to you. The kingdom is currently hard at work on an official set of palico equipment. It's really going to ruffle some fur. But it's also only going to be available to those who deliver a special treasure from the citadel. Think of this as a wonderful present you can give to your hardworking palicos. Head out and back that treasure. Deliver one piece of antique tableware. Hmm. I believe that should be an item in the citadel. Oh. R, do you perhaps have time? Huh. I must apologize, but I require your assistance yet again. The details have already been posted. Accept it when it suits you. For the kingdom. A camellios and oh, R. Master Karashi sent me a secret message. I'm told that the mercenaries witnessed some Kuri activity in the vicinity of a presently active master rank quest. Maybe the Kuri is why the monsters in that area seem more active than normal. And so, Master Karashi is calling on you, R, to dispatch your bodies to that area. If you spot any Kuryo, have your team investigate. He says. It's a dangerous mission, but you'll get heaps more materials. Get your lions, I mean loins, <laughs> and conquer this challenge. And yes, the appreciation ticket. Hmm. Ah, let's check it out when it's done. Needs only one more quest. And of course, it's a message from Elder Fugen and no one else. I wonder, did we just unlock a new... No, no gallery. Room customization... Room customization... And nope. No new one for defeating Guys Magor. Yaudi Hunter, I have some bunny dango you simply must try. They are called... Easy breezy dango. <laughs> when you perform a switch skill swap, you recover a little health. I hope dango can take you to even greater heights, even after defeating the archdemon of the abyss. The real treat is the, in the texture. It melts in your mouth in a most unusual way. Huh. That does seem like an interesting dango to use with the red reaction skill. R, Master Hammond gave me a few pointers to let me forge even more decorations for you. Take your pick and get that gear of yours in order. Sure, but first let me show the... Oh, use the camera. Let me show the skill I mean. Yes, the Lunagan one. This skill. When you perform a... Perfect times switch skill swap, 
you automatically dodge and pairing that up with the new pony tango seems like a good idea now then that's the Camino's armor nothing particularly special however the Archfiend armor <laughs> it looks really cool I'm not a big fan of the helmet but I like everything else, especially the cape that looks like the arms. Now then, let's see what his unique skill is. Dereliction. Curio will drain health, but also bolster your attacks. Multiple Curio further bolster attacks and let you recover health when performing a switch skill swap. So this also works well with redirection. Bolsters your attacks depending on which. I see, so depending on the switch kill, depending on the scroll, you get more elemental and status or more attack and stun. Actually, that for works perfectly fine with my current sword and shield setup. Since I keep elemental attacks on the red scroll and the stun attacks on the blue scroll however I'm not so sure about the drain health I prefer the blood right in that regard since it recovers health and let's check out the decorations pliable and blade scale <laughs> Firebug gauge recovers faster while wall running hmm there doesn't seem to be anything else ah how unfortunate I was expecting a level 4 attack boost duel maybe next time anti-rampage ones the Oster and Camellio so Hmm. The ah uh, yes, the, the uh, Aura Soul Jewel Tree. This is one that I really like, especially for weapons such as Sword and Shield, the Dual Blades, because they hit continuously. And this works like the old Chain Crit skill in old games. You get increased affinity. I believe twenty five, then thirty. Affinity after 5 hits and then 40 affinity after 10 hits. I could be wrong, but the point is you get a lot of affinity from continuous hits, which is really nice. A much cheaper alternative to running critical eye and sometimes weakness exploit. And also, there is of course this jewel, the dude range jewel for the hunting horn. <laughs> Quite a funny name. See you soon. Now then, the, for all your the kingdom is saved. The kingdom is saved. Uh -huh. As princess of the kingdom and on behalf of her majesty, I thank you. You have fulfilled your duty. <laughs> of course, of course. Okay, that's enough formalities. Official business. That's enough official business stuff. Now I can get back to my quest administration duties. Oh, and I have some great news too. You have unlocked your master rank cap. Congratulations. Nice. Yeah. It works the same as Hunter rank. Complete more quests and your rank increases. To so continue to soar our fears, savior of Camera and the kingdom, we're all excited to see what you'll achieve next. So yeah, I am still master rank 6 despite all I have done, which is a massive shame, however, with the cap unlocked, I can finally get to do the... I have finally more motivation to do these type of quests. And... There is also the Master Rank 6 unlocked. 
with a whole bunch of dangerous difficult quests this tree mm. yep Thura Jang in the fruit forest I hope we can talk again soon oh and I unlocked more stuff and a new dango which is Oh no, it's a new quest. Sticky secrets, sticking sauce. <laughs> By holding those three, huh? Just need the frenzy virus, the courier virus, and the poison virus. <laughs> and it looks like Obor has something to say. Sending greetings are. An associate of mine has informed me of a new way to use the melting pot. <laughs> Only certain materials may be used, but the outcome is more than worth it. But don't take my word for it. Why don't you try it out for yourself? All right. Good luck. And this is exactly what I have been waiting for. Look at all those points. The Let's expanded... Begin, yes, the expanded melting pot in order to... Create even bigger melting talisman, so let's try it out. 25 friend vouchers. Okay, and let's use an MPS Seren to see the results All immediately. Done. Load shells. Nice. Bad. 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 And bad. And of course, you can also use the melting nectar, honey, and pudding which were designed specifically for this purpose. All right, here we go. This is the type of stuff you can get from here, evade extender, or a bubble dance. Hmm. And I'm not a big fan of any of those, so let's simply put all of them on the reincarnation. Yes, not even this. this will be good. <laughs> and that way you can recycle your talismans into <laughs> even worse talismans. <laughs> Truly the Monster Hunter experience. Okay then. This will be good. So let's leave this one for after a quest is complete. All right, here we go. Okay then. Well, to see you again soon. Let's head to camera. Our time for us to get to it. Yep. Perfect time in Squirt. Apparently something's been tearing up the lava caverns, and that something is Magna Malo. However, <laughs> it would seem from the damage done and eyewitness reports that we're actually dealing with two big boys. <laughs> Sounds like this is a good chance to go out and give them a proper camera welcome. What do you say, Squirt? <laughs> lava caverns <Where>? litter box. <laughs> I love quest names like that. Leaves that all that's unlocked at the moment. So, in order to finish off this episode, let's do it by these are the available quests. doing one of these lower rank quests to show how far we have come. I'll do it with my trusty old charge blade. Wait, this one, yes, this one. With the right setup, an elemental charge blade is better than the. Uh, better than the stunning one, the stun one, <laughs> the impact type. But the impact type is better when you are fighting in general.
<laughs> and tail tip. More options. Hmm. Anyway, let's go. A dangerous dare. Nothing wrong with peaceful days, but a guy needs exciting from time to time. Want to do a test of courage tonight at the shrine ruins? Oh, I won't be going, of course. Tell me how it went, and I'll give you an armor recipe. Pingar the Sailor. And there is Guys Magorm, now in the right side of the loading screen. Look at that armor, I really like how it looks. Even without any layered armor, it still looks great. Now then, let's head towards... Bishoten. Whoops, I missed the head. And paralysis. <laughs> One tail slam, two, and no three. I'm still mistiming a little bit on where he will end up after that attack. That's a stun. <laughs> A little bit of proper positioning and you don't even need to jump. Just a nice eye. And just like that. thing about the flash attack with the charge blade you can simply counter it like that by design this way this is my favorite weapon at the very least against lower ranked monsters since they are not, not high on movement Inside. 
First overshooting, then undershooting. Flash and poison fruit. One, two, three. <laughs> Get down. And I am too close to do a side, so I simply use this one. And just like that, almost defeated. Too close? No. Nice. And that's me shutting down. Very quick and very easy with end game equipment. Bastard, buddy. Now then, on to Rathian. Now the flash fruit. That's a surprise tool that will help us later. Ready to go. And stun. A single charge blade counter like that. An eye is enough to. on a monster for the first time Flash fruit. <laughs> A little gear from the shot and for later. Whoops. And that's the Kittenator for you. Thanks, my buddy. Or was it stun? I don't know. Either way, the Kittenator is my favorite Palico skill. Rathian Ruby. Good as 
And I believe Baratheon should be ready to be defeated in just a little bit. Possibly. And that's the nice thing about Vishaten, you can use his fruit against other monsters. Enrage 1 and Enrage 2. That's two. Hmm. Okay, that one actually hit me. It's weird to see what hits you and what doesn't. It's one. And it's low longer in rage, so only one. Sadly, the disadvantage of the disadvantage, disadvantage of sunbreak is that you take a lot of chip damage, even if you don't want to, even if you have skills specifically designed to deal with avoiding as much chip damage as possible. I do have guard up, right? Yes, even even with guard and guard up, you, I still take a lot of chip damage from blocking attacks. Which is very sad. I wish there was some skill that restored some HP. Yes, that some skill that prevented taking chip damage at all. It was like restore all the chip damage you take every time you block an attack. <laughs> Either way, that's Bishaten and Rathian done quickly. We have really come far, and we have still much to go. So let's go see her. Let's go back to Elgato and check out the melding pot to see what is done. And wait. Ah, I don't have to talk to Pingar. What do we unlock from that quest? I can't even remember anymore. Here's a list of quests. 
Oh, I know more. Which is not Volvidon. Yukumu Sky. <laughs> That's a classic armor from Yukumu Village. And welcome to my shop. And if we get anything good from here. Not really. Hope to see you again soon. Oh well, that's part of life. So yes, I'll be doing this request from now on and I'll be trying to reach Master Rank 10 and see what we can find. So, see you then. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.